Jack. Well, we're back out with the yeah. A team today. <laughs> How are you getting on? What are you up to today? Uh, we're playing some ground for spring barley. Oh, right. Oh, so have you done most of the drilling yet then, uh, or is this towards the end? Or? Towards the end, I would say. Oh, right. Towards the end. It's How are you coping up. with the wet weather recently? Uh, dodging showers, but... Uh, yeah, it's all you can do at the minute. That's what part of farming is. It's all part of the fun, really. It is, yeah, yeah. Right, well, I think <laughs> one of the main things we've got to talk about, Jack, <laughs> is what's happened. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, I think we can quote we can quote you from the last video. The 76 Six is going. going. Yeah. <laughs> what happened? What happened? Well, I think it was like a couple, to, uh, a couple of weeks before this, the big girl came and yeah. Dad says, there's just so much stuff to take off it. And it does look a good piece of kit with the light Yeah, it does look smart. You, you brought a lot of add-ons for it that you had to take yeah. off if it was going. Yeah, <laughs> so we decided, like, it's a big enough tractor, tyres are still good on it, yeah. why should we swap it? So, 64 has gone to Slater's Agriculture. Oh, the, <laughs> so Mitch has got the 64 Mitch. now. <laughs> Let's hope he looks after it, keeps it, oh, well. keeps it in the he condition will. you guys are doing. Um, yeah. So you've had to park from the 64? Yeah. Not good? Not, not right, good. It's not good because it's <laughs> pure sand as well. Yeah. So what have you got now then? What's your uh, We've got the ATS 245 Dyna 7 gearbox. So what do you think of it? Do you like it, Jack? Or? Just under a month of having it. Yeah. Piece of nice kit tractor. this is. Yeah, yeah. So it's comfortable. It, it is comfortable. It's comfortable. Yeah. yeah. So what's different on it? Is it too uh, much getting used to then? Or? <laughs> well, the five star screen, the Agco one, is, it has to get used to. Right. something completely different to the 76 screen yeah but other than that really most of this is all the same it's all electric spools no manual because of the spec we chose of an exclusive right it's a big old cab on it isn't it yeah i think it's someone, got enough room i think, I think someone got the dimen dimension wrong. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so, yeah so um you've handed the 76 back down to your dad then yeah he's <laughs> so got he's it. got that on the drill yeah he's got it on the drill so uh, you're, you're still running the trim line and everything, are you? This is a Novotel system, which is far better for this type of job. Right. I can plough with it, I can do everything. I could go into trees, which I couldn't do with the Trimble one. Right. It's just far superior, so. Yeah, yeah. It's um, just a lot easier to get used to. So what, uh, what drill are you running then? I'm running Amazon's 3000 Centre. Right. That was a... That's a special one with the wheel markers, the radicators. And you like it? Yeah, so far so good. Over a year we've had it now. Right. And you're working in front of him with uh, the new plough. Yeah. The new plough, yeah. Go on then, tell us about the new plough. Uh, <laughs> well, back in the end of autumn, yeah. he says, we're going to have to change how we do things. Like, right. the ins and outs of the plough, and we get waves in the drilling and stuff then the spray will come along and the boom will be going up and down because right. it's bouncing on top of all the pigs troughs and it's just yeah. horrible for everyone really so yeah. he said we're going to change it have a near enough full spec five for with a pack of mat on it okay and have got spot on i reckon yeah because it's all compact on the plow no hassling just crack on with it plus yeah. with the auto reset you haven't got the carrying about the shear bolts but you have to carry about some bolts but it's not a great deal of what not used to the amount you'd be carrying no, around or um, really like yeah that came to us in middle of feb yeah so it didn't really coincide with the tractor which i wanted it to so i could set it up and yeah. stuff but so you went from a 640 to a 5, five a... but it's still the same width and weight yes right okay I see, yeah, I suppose having the forward press on it, it's a bit yeah, heavier. it's still a bit heavier. That is another thing that Caverna really, really didn't spec on the tractor is five spools. Right. So I suppose you need it for this Yeah, bell. we do need <laughs> it. It's got, well, with the press, you've got two rams. Right. One ram for the lifting, one ram for the, well, the in and out. Yeah. The width of it. Um, yeah. But we've had to have a tap on it. The tap was on the plough. Then beginning of April we decided right we're going to change it and we're going to have the tap on the tractor and it's just made it a far better system and your forward press is completely hydraulic yeah, as well is it complete except from them when you fold it up and stuff you've got the stabiliser okay you've got 
but other than that, it, so how does she carry on the road? Oh, she carry on the road. She's um, the wheel, so you don't have it raised up in the air anymore. No, so yeah, it's all like carried on the deck wheel. That's right, why the so. deck wheel is made so much bigger. Yeah, sturdier. Like yeah, yeah. you have to take the top link out when moving it. So you take drop it down, take the top link out, lift it back up again, and she sits on the links. Right. Okay. And then take two pins out the bottom, and you have free the run. Ready to go. So you're halfway through um, this bit of ground today. Yeah. What else have you been on recently? You've had the old uh, beat drill out, have you? Oh, have yes. you started beat drilling? Yeah, we decided yeah. beat drill. We've done about, no, 50 odd acres of drilling. Right. So, well, tell us a bit about that setup because the old girl gets to do that job. The old girl she? gets to do that job, <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Proper, so a, proper classic setup it is. It's <laughs> a Stan Hay 12 row beat drill. How many years have you been running the actual uh, beat drill itself then? Just over 40 years. 40 years? I know. And how many, how, well, how, how much is it planting this time? Uh, it's just, it's going to plant over 112, 115 acres. So it still does its bit? It still does its bit, yes. Yeah. Recently just brought a six metre coon. Oh, yeah, power Yeah, six, that was just brought out of nowhere. <laughs> so, <laughs> He went off shopping secretly he just went and off came shopping. back really. <laughs> Yeah, and you're running that in front of the beat drill, are you? Yeah. Or, and you managed to get all the beat dug in the end? Yeah, we got all the beat dug. It's all that over yeah, now? It's all, all out the yard? Out the yard, all done with. Until next time. Until next year. <laughs> Until the end of this year. Yeah. So how many hours has she done now then, Jack? Uh, the new piece? <laughs> in a month, she's done 70 hours. 70 hours. I mean, how long were you waiting for it? I mean, you, you know, you, you were waiting a bit when you're still running the... the yeah, we were the waiting for a bit, yeah. but we knew we were going to have to wait. Yeah. So... What dealers did you have it through? Uh, Keith Davis is our cultural service. It right. Was, we just saw... Tracks, both tracks were getting old, what do yeah. we do? 64 yeah. was 13 years old. So, so would she be... Is this track slightly smaller than your 76 uh, then? It's only just. It's only just, right. Much bigger. So you've got two tracks of the same size now then, really? Virtually the same yeah. size. The yeah. only reason why this is on the plow is just heavier. Right. It's more of a pulling tractor. Yeah. Rather than anything else. And have you got any uh, modifications coming for this uh, one? <laughs> a bit of ram mount. The camera, the trailer. Yeah. Any light bars? Oh yeah, we have got the light bars. <laughs> oh, you have got the light oh, bars. <laughs> so the method that you use, planting, ploughing and combi it drilling? always works. Yeah, that is, that is the way you, is that the way you plant everything? Yeah. yeah. Except from like, all seed drape, which is min till. Right. But I don't see any other option. No. If you've got a wet time, you're not going to go plow, uh, drill a field with a direct drill. No. Like, it's just too wet. It'd be okay at home where it's light soils, but... But anyway, I suppose over this way it's heavier, heavy. you know. Well, if it's always worked for you and... Yeah. You know, then... Like, we have weeds. Everyone has weeds on there. But ploughing, it buries the weeds and we haven't got to use the volume of ground. I know it's more fuel doing it this way, but... I couldn't see running a direct drill in this year today. No. Uh, I think there has been a lot of change. Yeah. A severe amount of change since she came out to <laughs> yeah. beat. Yes, there has been a big, <laughs> big change. Well, we were only out with you, what? January. A couple of months yeah, ago. beginning of the year it was. The whole, the whole setup it's, has changed, well, Jack. <laughs> it, it, was, it was change at the time. But. It was change at the time, yeah, it was, it was. Because <laughs> uh, you just missed us with the new plough. Yeah. Uh, yeah, I, well, that day I filmed you was literally a week before this yeah, one it was came, a week wasn't before, it? Yeah. 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 So have you? So you sold the old plough then? Have you? Yeah, it's both moved on. Them, both of them are gone. By the, oh, because you, yeah, you had two. Didn't round you? of five. Yeah. Round of five. But you'd have to keep that like running all day long. Right. Get it done. Right. Well, cheers for having us out today. Yeah, anyway, no worries. Um, it's good to see you getting on, and hopefully yeah. by the Did end of tomorrow you'll be all planted up. Fingers crossed. Yeah. <laughs> before the rainy. Oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so hopefully we'll be back out in harvest, won't it? Now? Yes, we'll see. Uh, we'll come and see you on your combine, I expect. With the, with the big, uh, yeah. <laughs> are you on the combine? Because uh, there's word of uh, John well, going on it. Yes. <laughs> oh, you are. Are you on it? Or uh, I've been decided. Those words is John being. <laughs> oh right. <laughs> we'll see you then. We'll see. Right. We'll come and yeah. see you then, Jack. Cheers yeah, no again, and we'll see, see you soon. See ya.